You testified yesterday that you sought a temporary restraining order on May 27th, 2016 because you wanted to change your locks. Do you remember that testimony? Yes, I do. Those locks were to the penthouses at the Eastern Columbia building, isn't that correct? That's correct. But you changed the locks to the penthouses on May 22nd, 2016. I attempted to. That's why you felt comfortable having James Franco over the evening of May 22nd, 2016, Ms. Hurd? I do not know when, I do not know when James came over. Okay, let's remind you. Can we please pull up Plaintiff's Exhibit 304, which is already in evidence, and play from 254 through 439? That's you and Mr. Franco on May 22nd, 2016, right, Ms. Hurd? That's correct. And you're taking him up to the penthouses, aren't you? That's where I lived, yes. And it's past 11 p.m. at night, isn't that right? I'm not quite sure of the time it looked, it looked like that. Why don't we pull that video back up? Twenty two fifty one. Almost midnight, right? That's uh, or excuse me, almost eleven o'clock at night. Exactly. Okay. You knew Mr. Depp was out of town the week of May twenty one, two thousand sixteen, didn't you? I don't know what I knew of his schedule at the time. You knew Mr. Depp was out of town on May twenty seventh when you went to get the domestic violence restraining order, isn't that right? I don't know if I knew that at the time. You knew you knew Mr. Depp was heading out on a European tour that week, isn't that right? I'm not quite sure what I understood of his schedule at that time. You knew he wouldn't be back for weeks, right? No, that's incorrect. Let's uh, go back to that recording. It's uh, Defendant's Exhibit 598. Uh, so you testified that you and Mr. Depp were in the car outside of his studio. Is that right? Yes. And you were trying to prevent him from going into his studio to do drugs, right? Uh, yeah, to effectively start another cycle. Right. Not that Mr. Depp was just trying to go into his house to see his daughter, right? His daughter might be one of the people that was in the house at that time, but that's so neither here nor there. That your testimony is now him from entering a cycle. <laughs> your testimony is now that Mr. Depp does drugs in front of his children? Well, first of all, I know he does. Um, second of all, it wouldn't have mattered. It wouldn't have stopped him from using with his friends, which is the problem, not whether or not his daughter was there. 